Living in Pittsburgh, it's hard not to be impressed by the amount of vacant and blighted land in the city. Just along this strip of the street that we're on, there's over a hundred parcels of vacant land, this being one of them. This is an example of the kinds of things that can happen on vacant land, and this is an example of a site that we've helped reclaim. But it's very, very difficult to start from a vacant lot and end with a community garden. One of the big things that GTEC does is to cultivate sunflowers so that we can transition vacant space into community assets. Property adjacent to green space increases in value up to 20%, whereas property adjacent to unmanaged vacant land decreases by 20%. When we have a small success in the form of sunflowers on a vacant lot, that starts building a critical mass momentum for people to figure out how to utilize the resources that are around us in a more thoughtful, intentional, and efficient way. Community development doesn't have to be just bricks and mortar. There's the opportunity for a community to get engaged and do development through greening. And the green economy is really the next step and the opportunities to revitalize our cities will really come through that. So what we're trying to do is capture those markets as they emerge to help the people that are in these communities get jobs and rebuild their communities communities.